Good morning. Uh, today we will discuss about disease of blood system. We will discuss about anemia uh, about, and about gammablastosis and disease of uh, organs of lymphoreticular uh, system. Also, <coughs> disease of blood system. First diagnosis. To define the peculiarities of anemia, morphogenesis, and other blood diseases, the sternal function <coughs> of marrow biopsy is widely used. In breastbone or sternum punctate, it is possible to diagnose leukemia and the marrow regeneration level under the anemia as well as the type of erythropoiesis, erythroblastic, normoblastic, megaloblastic variant. Also, anemia. Anemia is a blood disease of erythrocytes quantity or the hemoglobin saturation. In the periphery blood can appear erythrocytes of different size, poikilocytosis, poikilocytemia, different shape, anisocytosis, different level of chlorine, hyperchromatism and hypochromatism. Erythrocytes with inclusions, jollies, corpusculis, capus, rings. Nuclear erythrocytes, erythroblast, normal blast, megaloblasts. Uh, in this uh, picture, uh, we demonstrate uh, cytological in <coughs> signs of uh, anemia. For example, uh, there is also a nuclear uh, venous uh, this uh, anemia, abnormal and aged, uh, typically removed by spleen. The appearance of increased poikilocytosis and anisocytosis. In this uh, uh, picture. Cytological research, the size of many of this uh, anemia, quite small, with lack or central zone failure. <coughs> this anemia is present spherocytosis in hereditary spherocytosis, is a lack of spectrum, a case cyt cytoskeletes membrane protein. This produce membrane instability that force the cell to the smallest volume as fire. In the laboratory this is shown by increased osmotic uh, fragility. The spherocytosis do not surface as long as normal abnormal anemia. Classification of anemies. According to the etiology and pathogenesis, there are three groups of anemias. Post-gemorrhagic anemia as a result of blood loss, anemia as a result of gematosis disturbance, and uh, gemolytic anemia as a result of increased erythrocytes destruction. According to the clinical cause, anemias can be acute and chronic. Also, first variant, Anemia uh, post-gemorrhagic. Post-gemorrhagic anemia classification uh, and uh, to acute post-gemorrhagic anemia and chronic post-gemorrhagic anemia. Uh, post-gemorrhagic anemia develops as a result of gemorrhagia uh, from vessels of stomach or bowel and the ulcer or tumoric affection. Of uterine tube rupture under the extra uterine pregnancy, of aortic rupture, of lung vessels spread under tuberculosis and other causes. In this uh, picture, microscopically, uh, signs of develop postgemorrhagic anemia, chronic postgemorrhagic anemia by chronic stomach ulcer. Ulcer edges are gastric due to connective tissue spread in the surface of a row. Also bottom particularly 
Oh, and a whole area of dark brown painting. Pathologic process, crudis vessels, a wall, and hemorrhagia appear, hemorrhagia appear, diabrosin. Hemoglobin under hydrochloric acid affecting uh, turns to muriatic hematin of dark brown painting which paints the ulcer bottom and walls. Prolonged stomach hemorrhages under the ulcerose disease are complicated with chronic post-hemorrhagic anemia. In this uh, picture, microscopically signs uh, develop a, maybe acute post-hemorrhagic anemia after cardiac or pericardial tamponade. In the cavity, the blood is seen. On the heart top, there is a spread subpericardial myocardial infarction. In this. this is a recurrent myocardial infarction with myomalacy. The myomalacy area is filled with blood, while this area, the blood from the left ventricle cavity arrived to the cardiac cavity and the tamponade appeared. The rest came as a result of abrupt pressure change in the cardiac ventricles hole and it stops in the systole pulse. In this uh, picture, we demonstrate uh, hemorrhage in abdominal cavity. You can see accumulation blood in uh, abdominal cavity. This results in formation acute post-hemorrhagic anemia. And uh, as a rule, best patient. These two present uh, post-operative -hemorrha post hemorrhage in abdominal cavity, accumulation blood in blood in abdominal cavity and develop acute uh, post hemorrhagic anemia and you can see this may be rupture of uh, uh, spleen. Also, acute post hemorrhagic anemia comes of the big vessel bleeding and the dress occur for first uh, the morphologic manifestation of anemia appear. The chronic post hemorrhagic anemia develops of the prolonged bleeding of small vessels. Also, morphology of post hemorrhagic anemia. The blue skin, mucous tunics, and internal organs. A red marrow of flat bones, epiphyseal plates, hyperplasia, and turns to intense succulent. Yellow marrow metaplasia to red. There appear the centers of extramedullary hematosis in the spleen, thymus, lymph nodules, and other tissues. As a result of hypoxia, oxygen, starvation in the internal, they, are, they can develop dystrophic change, small hemorrhage in mucus and serous tunics. In this uh, picture, microscopically signs subpericardial hemorrhages on the front heart surface by the course of the terminal branch of coronary vessels to subpericardial diabetic hemorrhage are seen the dark brown maculus of vacua outlines. Increased vessels penetrability is caused by hypoxia thrombocytopenia, which break as a result of a compensatory high spread of myeloid or lymphoid gematopoietic shots with the corresponding operation of other erythrocytic, thrombocytic, megalocarocytic. The brown painting is explained by the local gemocidrosis. In this uh, picture, microscopically signs of uh, post-hemorrhagic anemia, maybe chronic post-hemorrhagic anemia, where they look fatty hepatosis. In a cut, the liver has yellow painting, while the whole straits a little increased, the capsule is smooth. Fatty dystrophic liver appear under chronic anemia as a result of hypoxia. Under hypoxia, there appears the hyperlipemia because of the nutrients 
which not completely released as a plastic and energetic material. The small blood arrives to liver with arterial blood. Also, under the heart oxygen deficiency apoptosis, hepatocytes are not able to split completely the fat which arise to liver from intestine via portal vein. Liver function low on this. In this microscopically picture present signs of chronic post-hemorrhagic anemia. Ordinary simple general adiposity. In the macro preparation there is represented subcutaneous fat of front abdominal wall of 10-12 cm. This adiposity is probable under chronic anemia as a result of nutrients which not completely used as plastic and energetic material with suffering of fats in depot. Anemia as a result of gematosis disturbance. The lobes under the deficiency of iron, the deficiency of B12 vitamin, folic acid. To this type, hypo and aplastic anemia are numbered. Acidotic or iron deficiency anemia is always hypochromic and develops under the poor arrival of iron into the organism with food. Such anemias are common among children and also under intense need of iron while pregnancy, female juvenile or climacteric chlorosis. This anemia can appear under the stomach bowel disease especially after the resection. In this picture present uh, cytological signs of uh, hypochromic anemia. The most common cause for hypochromic microcytic anemia is iron deficiency. The most common nutritional deficiency is lack of dietary iron. This uh, iron deficiency anemia is common person most at risk their children and women in reproductive ways from menstrual blood loss and from pregnancy. A vitamin B12 and folic deficiency enemies. Other name or synonyms of B12 and folic deficiency enemy are megaloblastic anemia hyperchromatism anemia, perniciosus or birman birman erlich anemia. Uh, this cytological uh, picture presents signs of hyperchromic anemia. There is a hypersegmented neutrophil that is present with megaloblastic anemia. There are eight lobes in test of the usual three or four. Such anemias can be due to folate or to B12 deficiency. The size of uh, this anemia is also increased macrocytosis, which is hard to appreciate in a blood sphere. Pathogenesis of vitamin B12 and folic deficiency anemia are designed by erythrogenesis destruction and appear and under food B12 vitamin disturbance in the stomach which is observed under its diseases when gastromucoprotein secretion propolis is met. Such change can be of hereditary origin or autoimmune genesis is very important, important autoimmune genesis. Etiology of this anemia. Under the lymphogranulomatosis, polyposis, syphilis, corrosive, necrotic, toxic, chemical gastritis, malignant growth of stomach. After the stomach bowel resection, there can appear peninsula like anemia. The cause of such anemia can be exogenous deficiency of B12 vitamin or folic acid of children fed on goat's milk.
Protogenesis. The gamopoiesis is released by the megaloblastic type and the blood destruction next is the gematosis, morphology of vitamin B12 folic deficiency anemia. The pathomorphologic manifestation of this anemia are as next, liver, spleen, kidney gemosiderosis, fat degeneration of parenchymatous organs, general obesity, uh, bleach, lemon, thin pit skin, small hemorrhages in mucus, rose tonics, and skin. In gastrointestinal tract there are atrophic and sclerotic change. The marrow turns to raspberry red with the predominance of erythroblast, normoblast, and megalocarioblast. In lateral and posterior Dorsal columns of spinal cord, there is funicular myelosis in the brain, there are the centers of encephalomalacy and ischemia. Hypoplastic and aplastic anemia can be endogenous or inherited family aplastic anemia of Fanconi and Erlich, hypoplastic anemia, and exogenous or acquired radiation toxic influence and medicamentosis anemias. In this uh, gistological picture present signs formation of hypoplastic anemia. Hematopoietic elements in this bone marrow biopsy are markedly reduced. This is cause of aplastic anemia. Of course such anemia platelets and granular sites will often be diminishing. Sometimes a drug or toxic is the cause and sometimes infection. When no known cause can be found, it is termed idiopathic aplastic anemia. Gemolytic anemia is characterized by increased erythrocytes destruction, which can be intravascular and extravascular. Intravascular anemia, hemolytic, appear when hemolytic poisons get into the organism under the such factors. Bad lead burns, toxic anemia, under malaria, sepsis, and other infection, infection in anemias, under blood transfusion of incompatible blood group or resus factor post transfusion anemia and the immune pathologic process, immune, isoimmune, and autoimmune anemias, gamolytic disease of newborns, chronic lympholeukosis, marrow cardio uh, carcinomatosis, systemic lupus erythematose, medicamentosis, immune gemolysis, thermal gemoglobinuria, and other factors. This uh, uh, cytological uh, picture present signs uh, develop hemolytic anemia uh, cause malaria. Malaria is a parasite disease caused by the genus Plasmodium, of which the four spies that affected men show here ring forms of Plasmodium. Uh, we said in red blood cells. This disorder can produce gemo and anemia. Extravascular or intracellular anemia is mostly of inherited origin and divides into erythrocytopathy, erythrocytoenzymopathy and gemoglobinopathy. Erythrocytopathy anemia to the gemolytic anemia of such origin as erythrocytes membrane structure defect arranged such diseases as microspherocytosis, inherited ovalocytosis, and other. Erythrocytoenzyme hepatic hemolytic anemia appear because of enzyme deficiency of pentosophosphate cycle glucose 6-phosphate dihydrogenase and pyruvate kinase. This anemia grows progressively with and various infections, usage of some. Recommends. 
hemoglobin or hepatic hemolytic anemia, the lobes and the disturbance of hemoglobin synthesis, A and B thrasemia, or under appearance of abnormalities hemoglobin C, S, D, E, polkaid cellular anemia can combine the hemoglobinopathies. <coughs> Morphologic manifestations of hemolytic anemia are mainly very specific. General gemosiderosis, gemolytic gendice in serious causes with gemoglobinuric nephrosis, splenomegaly and uh, inherited gemolytic anemia, presence of centers of extramedullar gemopoiesis. Next variant of pathology blood is leukosis. Leukosis are systemic tumoric disease of gametopoietic tissue, blood forming tissue, which are characterized by the progressive overgrowth of tumoric cells, leukemia cells. First, tumoric cells increase in gametopoietic organs, marrow, lymph nodes, spleen, and then gametogenous spread in whole organism with infiltration of some organs and also appear in periphery blood. In this uh, histological picture present signs uh, a change in bone marrow by leukemia. In contrast to aplastic anemia, leukemia result is a highly cellular marrow. The marrow between the pink bone Trabecular seen here is nearly 100% cellular and it consists of leukemic cells of acute lymphocytic leukemia <coughs> that have virtually replaced or suppressed normal hematopoiesis. Thus, though the marrow is quite cellular, there can't be periphery cytopenes. This explains the complication of infection, lack of normal leukocytes, gemorrhage, lack of platelets, and anemia, lack of red blood cells, that often appear with leukemia. <coughs> also, leukemia is progressive overgrowth of leukemic cells, leads to anemia, gemorrhagic syndrome, dystrophy change in parenchymatous organs, immunity oppression, also necrotic and septic complications. Etiology can be not always indefinite since it is a polyteologic disease. The cause can be genetic and inherited factors, hormonal abnormality, and all factors which can cause cellular mutation. Gematopoietic system. To the mutation genus, are numbered virus, retrovirus, Epstein Barr DNA virus, ionization radiation, chemical compounds, benzpirin, pesticides, herbicides, benzene, ring compounds, and other. Classification of leukemia is based on the morphological and cytochemical peculiarities of tumoric cells of marrow. The Divide uh, acute and chronic leukosis according to the level of differentiation of tumoric blood cells and their development, non-malignant or malignant. Acute leukosis are characterized by proliferation of non-differentiated or differentiated plastic cells and have malignant development. Chronic leukosis are characterized by proliferation of differentiated leukemic cells and relative non-malignant development. As to quantity of leukocytes and leukocyte cells, there are the next variants of leukosis. Leukemic, 100,000 of cells per 1 millimeter microliter of blood, subleukemic, not more than 15-25,000 cells, leukopenic, lowering of leukocytes quantity but with their presence, alikemic, no leukosis in periphery blood. Acute leukosis, as to morphologic and cytochemical peculiarities of leukocytes are divided into lymphoblastic 
and myeloblastic leukosis or lymphoblastic and non-lymphoblastic. As to knowledge, knowledge of gematosis among the acute leukosis are non-differentiated, myeloblastic with blast mutation, promyelocytic, myelomonocytic, monocytic, monoblastic, erythroleukosis, mehalocardioblastic variants, which develop from spinal cells or cells precursors of class second or fourth among the lymphoblastic leukosis according to immunal and cytogenic characteristics there are three morphologic forms l1 l2 l3 clinical pathologic characteristic of acute leukosis the first Manifestation of acute leukosis is the presence of blastic cells in plantation of marrow of breast bone. Second, marrow of breast bone change is painting and consistence red, succulent, sometimes with gray shade under non differentiated form, pyoid under myeloblastic form, raspberry red under lympholeukosis. Set signs in the peripheral blood, the leukemic uh, hiatus develops. It is a great number of blastic cells, a two lead of mature and total absence transferring cell forms. And fourth, there is a substitution of marrow with the new blastic leukemic cells. Vice. Gradually, leukemic infiltration appears in the spleen, liver, lymph nodules, kidneys, manix, brain tunics, neuroleukemia and the lymphoblastic leukosis, mucous tunics of gastrointestinal tract, lungs, leukemic pneumonia, pneumonitis, and the myeloleukosis, and other organs. Six. There develops anemia, thrombocytopenia, and other. Gemorrhagic syndrome present very often by acute leukosis. You can see gemorrhagic syndrome on skin, mucous tunic, serous tunic, internals, cerebrum. Necrotic tonsillitis, engine, septic complication, dystrophic ch change in parenchymatous organs very often present by acute leukemia. In children, acute leukosis have acute uh, leukosis more often there can be inherited forms of disease, there are nodular infiltration in different organs. The most common is tip dependent lymphoblastic leukosis. The less common is myeloblastic leukosis. This cytological picture acute lymphoblastic uh, lymphocytic leukemia. Uh, this is present uh, leukocytes, but the blast very imma immature cells with large nuclei that contain nuclei. Such lymphocytes are indicate of acute lymphocytic leukemia. Acute lymphocytic leukemia is more common in children than adults. Many causes of acute lymphocytic uh, leukemia in children respond well to treatment and many are curable. Cause of death by uh, acute leukemia. First, septic complication, especially often meet under non differentiated form. Ulceral necrotic complication, gemorrhages, especially dangerous into cerebrum, which are often met under polo. Uh, promyelocytic leukosis, progressive disease. Uh, medical uh, pathomorphies of acute leukosis. Under the influence of therapy and the leukosis, the gemorrhagic diathesis, necrotic change in mucous tunic of decreased mouse oral cavity, more often the match also necrotic change in tunics of gastrointestinal tract. Lycemic pneumonitis, lycemic meningitis, chronic leukemia, chronic leukosis, 
are divided into leukosis of myelocytic origin, leukosis of lymphocytic origin, and leukosis of monocytic origin, myelomonocytic leukosis and histiocytosis. This is a uh, cytological picture of chronic uh, uh, leukosis. The mature lymphocytes are increased markedly in number. They are indicated of chronic lymphocytic leukemia, a disease most often seen in older adults. This disease responds poorly to treatment, but it is indolent. Chronic leukocytes of myelocytic origin or myeloproliferal uh, disease are represented generally by chronic myelosis or chronic myeloid leukosis, chronic erythromyelosis, polycytemia, erythromyelosis, myelofibrosis. Chronic myeloid leukosis has two stages, monoclonal, non-malignant and polyclonal or malignant variant. The first stage lasts several years and is characterized by progressive increase of neutrophiloid leukocytes with transfer to myelocytes. At the later stage, in 3-6 months, there develops polyclonism. Plastic cells form appear, myeloblast, erythroblast, monoblast, and other blast crises appear. The quantity of erythrocytes in blood increased to 7 million per 1 microliter on manifestation on acute leukosis develop. Morphological uh, signs of chronic myeloid leukemia. The marrow is red with gray, succulent, pyoidic, the blood is gray with red, internal, uh, anemic. This cytological signs of chronic myeloid leukemia. He is another wave of uh, periphery blood so in the patient with chronic myeloid leukemia. Often the numbers of basophils and eosinophils, are well the bands of and more immature myeloid cells metamyelocytes and myelocytes are increased. Unlike acute myeloid leukemia, there are not many blasts with chronic myeloid leukemia. Morphological signs of chronic myeloid leukemia. The spleen is abruptly increased to 6-8 kg of gray with brown painting atrophied follicles, sclerosis and gamosiderosis of pulp, leukemic infiltrates, leukemic thrombi in vessels, the liver is increased to 5-6 kg, or gray with brown painting, leukemic infiltration along the sinusoid, fatty dystrophy of gapatocytes, gamosiderosis. Lymph nodes are diffusely very increased, so for gray with red painting. Myelofibrosis is characterized by presence of myeloid leukosis manifestation and change of marrow to connective or bone of solstice. Thus the disease has a prolonged non-malignant cause. Erythromyia is met among the elderly people and is characterized by increasing of mass of erythrocytes, thrombocytes, granulocytes in periphery blood, increased blood arterial pressure, inclination to thrombosis, splenomegaly. A chronic uh, lymphocytic uh, leukemia are represented by chronic lympholycosis, skin lymphomatosis, cesare disease, and paraproteinemic leukemia. Also, chronic lympholeukemia develops among elderly people appear from B lymphocytes, but with abrupt lowering of immunoglobulin formation, development of autoimmune reactions, increased quantity of leukocytes in periphery blood, 
to 100,000 per 1 microliter. Lichemic infiltrates are present in all organs. Morphological signs. The marrow is red. The spleen is increased to 1 kilogram of red painting. Follicles are increased due to lichemic infiltration. The liver is increased of gray with brown painting. Lichemic infiltration along the portal tract fatty dystrophy of hepatocytes. Leaf nodes are abruptly increased thick in the form of bugs can squeeze the neurobony organs of gray with pink painting. The kidney are greatly increased. Lichemic infiltration abruptly disturbing parenchymal structure. Infection complication and gemolytic status are typical due to this as uh, this uh, histological signs uh, one uh, develop complication by chronic lymphocyte lympholeicosis by formation pneumonia infection complication as this uh, microscopically signs lympholeicosis by present increased mesenterial nodes on the macro preparation the intestine and increased mesenterial lymph nodes of back shape are represented Diameter of some nodes is re reach 5 cm. The nodal pulp is homogeneous of white painting. The nodes are increased because of extramedullary gematosis. The back of abruptly increased mesenterial lymph nodes can press the vessels, nerves, which clinically manifest the tumor. A tumor of plasmatic cells or paraproteinemic leukemia. They look from, from B lymphocytic system, the precursors of plasmic, plasmatic cells. The cells synthesis the pathologic protein paraproteins. To this group of leukosis are numbered myeloma, myelomatosis, plasmacytoma, Carl's disease, van der Streams, macroglobulinopenia, Franklin's disease of heavy chains. Myeloma is caused by spread of tumoric cells of lymphoblast plasmatic line, myelomic cells in marrow with bones destruction. In periphery blood, they accumulated the pathologic proteins, paraproteins, which segregate into urine through the kidneys, Ben Jones protein. As two character of myelomic infiltrates is marrow and bones they are divided. Diffusely, diffusely nodal, multiply form of disease. The most affection there are the flat bones, skull and ribs, vertebrae, more seldom tubal, with the development of bone tissue destruction. In the bones there are developed osteolysis and osteoporosis. Myelomic infiltration is also observed in the internals, spleen, liver, kidneys, lungs, lymph nodules. Complication by myeloma, paraproteinemic nephrosis, myelomically wrinkly kidneys, renal amyloidosis, amyloidosis nephrosis, inflammatory change as pneumonia, pyelonephritis. The other forms of paraproteinemic leukosis are seldom accompanied with bones destruction. In this uh, picture, microscopically signs one complication by myeloma is formation of renal amyloidosis. The kidney is increased of homogeneous with white, white painting. The edges between organ in areas is absent. Renal amyloidosis complicated myeloid leukemia very often. This histological signs uh, complication by myeloma where formation of amyloidosis plasmocytes pro uh, why develop such complications? Because plasmocytes product a great number of plasmoglobulins which go out via kidneys, Benz Jones protein and uh, constipate them. 
Besides the destruction products of brown tissue, also of protein naturally go out of the organism or kidneys and constipate the renal filter, the walls of glomerular capillaries, paint in pink color. A tumor disease of lymph nodules or lymphomas. To this group are numbered lymphosarcoma, uh, mycosis, fungosis, fungoids, causary disease, reticulosarcoma, Hodgkin disease, lymphogranuloma. But today, uh, lymphomas classification uh, Hodgkin's lymphoma and not Hodgkin's, non Hodgkin's lymphoma. Hodgkin also today, today. There are Hodgkin's lymphoma and non Hodgkin's lymphoma. They can be B and T cellular lymphomas or lymphomas, lymphoma, lymphocytomas are ectomary tumors which consist of different lymphocytes or of lymphocytes and pro-lymphocytes. They appear in lymph nodules or lymphoid tissue of the other uh, internals. They are characterized by the local growth and normal malignant cause. The first manifestation of lymphomas are increased peripheral lymph nodules. They become thicker, mobile, non-painful. Later there appear the manifestation of intoxication, generally weakness, weight loss, nitrate, which is a manifestation of tumoric process. Transformation into lymphosarcoma is met seldom and after the long time. Lymphosarcoma or malignant variant of lymphoma. Also, lymphosarcoma or malignant variant of lymphoma is a malignant lymphoma of mediastinal, extraperitoneal injury, lymph nodules, and lymph tissue of gastrointestinal tract. The nodes increase with the necrotic and hemorrhagic areas. Process generalization cause lymphately and gematogenously. To this group are uh, numbered Burkitt's lymphoma, Burkitt's tumor, endemic disease of African children, and facial skeleton bones are damages. The cause is a herpetrophic virus. In this picture present the signs of metastasis lymphoma in kidney, this variant malignant variant malignant for form of lymphomas. Lymphoma lymphosarcoma or malignant lymphoma of kidney present in this picture too. Hodgkin disease or lymphogranulomatosis is a chronic recurrent lymphoma with affection of cervical, mediastinal, extraperitoneal, injury lymph nodules. There are isolated, local, and spread generalizing forms. The spleen is often affected necrosis nodules of white with yellow painting, sclerosis, lymphocytic infiltration, and that's why it turns to very rigid and porphyrilic look. In lymph nodules there appear uh, proliferation of leukocytes, kistiocytes, reticulate cells, eosinophils, plasmatic cells, neutrophils, leukocytes, necrosis and sclerosis nodules, atypical mononuclear small and big Hodgkin cells, polynuclear giant red Brzezowski stemmer cells. In this picture present signs, uh, histological signs of uh, lymphogranulomatosis, uh, uh, or Hodgkin's disease and uh, in center of this picture present large prominent nuclei. This is Hodgkin's disease mixed cellular type a mixed cellular uh, population is present. This form of Hodgkin disease tends to the disseminated. This is Hodgkin disease lymphocytes depletion type many red stem, Berezovsky stemberg cells and variants are present since had a medium and high magni magnification. This type of Hodgkin disease is not common. Uh, 
also uh, Hodgkin's uh, disease or lymphogranulomatosis uh, uh, have four clinical pathological forms. Uh, first, predominance of lympho, lymph tissue, lymphohistiocytotic uh, variant, first, second stage of disease, its low cost form. Nodular sclerosis is much under non malignant cause of disease. Mixed cellular variant appears there, and the disease uh, spread and corresponding uh, to the second sad stage operation of lymph tissue variant is typical for the generalized form. And uh, has a malignant cause, sometimes called Hodgkin's sarcoma. Hodgkin's sarcoma. Thank you very much.